Hello everyone, Joe with LME Services, and today I'm going to show you how to share a Google Drive file via a URL. So it's a fairly sim simple process, it just starts by going to the file within Google Drive and opening it up. So in this case I just have a PDF, I double click on it, and then I click on these three dots here up on the top right, and I have to make sure that the file is actually shareable, otherwise it's private, and even if you did share the URL they won't be able to see it because they don't have rights to it. So what we do is we just click on advanced here on the bottom right and instead of it being private we just change it to public aka on public to the web. This means that anybody can access it and they give you a little description here on what specifically you're giving so you have to understand that when you want somebody to be able to download this it means anybody can download it if they know the URL. So obviously you don't want to share anything too um, private. So in this case we'll just hit save and done and now this is a shareable file now you'll notice you can't just share this URL with anybody because well this, even if you did share this is just gonna take them nowhere so you click on this again hit share and now you'll see you have this option here and you can get the shareable link alright so if you click on this it just copies the URL and if you were to paste that URL you'll see that it would bring up that file now you can send that to people but a lot of times they'll have a hard time viewing it or it, depending on their Google account they may not be able to access it so the second step that we did find was uh, fairly important this is the part where it allows you to actually just download the file rather than going to view it like this so you go to this website the Google Drive direct link generator and you can see the URL right here just go ahead and copy that and once you copy that and go to this website you'll simply paste that shareable link in here hit create direct link and it's going to create an output link alright so just create link control C to copy it now control V to paste it hit enter and you'll see how the getting started PDF just automatically downloaded it didn't take me to a website it didn't ask me anything and if you sent that URL to somebody it would automatically download the file without any prompts. So now if I click it, I've got the PDF. It's actually on my computer now in my downloads folder. Now, while this URL is nice, it can be so long that sometimes people get a little perturbed by it or have a hard time copying and pasting it because they miss uh, the beginning or the end of it. So the third and final step that we like to, to do for people is to just take this URL to bit.ly.com. And the nice thing about bit.ly is it merely takes very long URLs like this one and creates a short one. So now if I just copy this, go to that same URL, you'll see on the bottom it downloaded the file. So now I could just send somebody this simple little 12 uh, character URL and they will get the file. So I can just pop this in an email, share it via text or any way you want. It's a very easy thing to just click on and get a file. So it's a great way to share files uh, via Google Drive very simply. Uh, via URL. If you have any questions, just post them on the comments below. Give us a like if you thought this video was useful. Thanks.